and welcome to this week's edition of IJF News. I am Malpe Moashan. This week, the first batch of Black Starless have reported to Pram Pram. GFA to pass its new national football agent regulations by July 31st, 2023. The first batch of players of the national under 17 male team, otherwise known as the Black Starlets, reported to the Ghanaman Center of Excellence at Pram Pram on Wednesday, February 15th, 2023, for camping. The players were selected from the recent scouting exercise that took place across the 10 football regions of the country. The selected players will undergo training, screening, and also play test matches as the top quality ones will be picked out to form the nucleus of the next Black Starlets. In all, about 150 players will have the opportunity to be observed by the under-17 technical team led by Asante Kotoko and Ghana legend Abdul Karim Zitu. The first badge of players reported on Wednesday, February 15th, while the second and the third batches will report on Monday, February 20th and Friday, February 24th, 2023, respectively. Ghana were denied a passage to the 2023 Under-17 African Cup of Nations after losing 1-0 to Burkina Faso in the semi-finals of the Wafu Zone B Under-17 Cup of Nations in Cape Coast last year. The Black Starlets have not played at the Under-17 African Cup of Nations and FIFA Under-17 World Cup since 2017. The IGF crew will be visiting the camp to interact with management and players. On 16th December 2022, the FIFA Council approved the FIFA Football Agent Regulations. The FIFA Football Agent Regulations will replace FIFA's existing regulation on working with intermediaries fully on October 1st, 2023, and will provide the regulatory framework governing football agents and the performance of football agent services worldwide. The new regulations entered into force partly on January 9, 2023, in relation to Article 1 to 10 and Articles 22 to 27, which generally relate to the processes for obtaining a license as an agent. The remaining parts of the new regulation will come into force on October 1st, 2023. These remaining articles generally relate to acting as a football agent and obligations of football agents and clients. For the avoidance of doubt, the obligation of clients to only utilize football agents to perform football agent services in relation to a transaction commences for all transactions as from October 1st, 2023. The regulation of the occupation of football agents within the context of football transfer system is a core element of FIFA's strategic goal of modernizing the football regulatory framework as identified in making football truly global, the fishing 2020 to 2023. In accordance with Article 3 of the FFAR, FIFA member associations such as the Ghana Football Association must implement and enforce their national football agent regulation by 30th September 2023 to transition from FIFA regulations on working with intermediaries to the FFAR. FIFA and the GFA have a statutory obligation to regulate all matters relating to the football transfer system. The core objectives of the football transfer systems are to protect the contractual stability between professional players and clubs, encourage the training of young players, promote a spirit of solidarity between elite grassroots football, protect minors, maintain competitive balance, and ensure the, regulatory, the regularity of sporting competitions. The GFA will continue to update its members and stakeholders of all the developments in this area of the beautiful game. Thank you for joining us. Follow us on social media at Inside Juvenile Football for more updates. I am Malpemo Ashan.